Hello, welcome or welcome back. And thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for watching my Elite Dangerous The Day to Day Grind series. And I've got a new promotion going on for new subscribers. If you have subscribed within the last 28 days, then you're eligible for a drawing. I go to my YouTube page and click the About, About tab. And there you'll see the details. The reason I put it there and not all of it in the video is because you could watch this video five years after it is published. And things might have changed based on YouTube rules and all those kinds of things. So uh, check the About page out. But if you're a subscriber, or if you'll subscribe today, you're eligible if you follow the details in the About tab uh, t for a drawing. So again, thanks for watching and scroll down. If you're not a subscriber to the right, you see a red and white button that says subscribe. Please press that and you'll be eligible for the drawing each week. That's every week we give away prizes to our subscribers. So check it out. And you'll see to the left of the uh, subscribe button, far left, you'll see my YouTube channel, GFM underscore RDG. Click there and then you'll see the About tab at the top. You'll also see the Featured video and my series slash playlist. Okay. We're going back to Baal after delivering mission and... Uh, donating to the Empire to get our allied status back to a hundred percent but we need to pick up our stuff because we're going to run out to the Alliance and top it off because it's down to like 78 I think uh, sis right find that under status sis right sis right okay finally Okay, we're down to 89. So we need to top that off at 100. And you see that we changed the Empire Allied status back to 100. Didn't take very long. Okay. Sis left. And I killed my... I want to see stations and systems. Okay, I think I'm ready now. Auto launch. And I say auto launch, but sometimes that's scary because the auto launch can run into things. Have you seen in a previous video where it runs into a structure inside the uh, station? Engines engaged. Of a large station. Waiting for the auto launch to complete. Go ahead and accelerate. Locate our destination. Watch out for the station sure we don't run into it. We're going back to Baal to pick up the uh, fuel tanks. Then we'll search for an alliance, close by alliance system. And then we'll go out to Rhea. Rhea, they have a Federation uh, warship. And one of those mega warships. I'm going to see one of those. 
under construction just like we did for the Imperial warship. Is this left? Yeah, we're at 5.8. It's going to take a couple kilometers before they release us. Or you can exit to the main menu, come back, and you'll be 10 kilometers from the station. And then you can go ahead and go if you're impatient. If I was playing by myself and I didn't have a video running, I'd go ahead and do that. Okay, there it is. But you should play the way you would like to play. It's the way I see it. Ready to engage. Three, two, one, engage. If you want to play like a purist, you should be able to. If you want to play like a non-purist, you should be able to. That's the way I see it. Especially in solo mode, you should play the way you want to play. In open, that's a little bit different because you affect other people. It's only 150 light seconds, so I have to back off the throttle a little bit. We'll go by the mega warships again to get to the station so we can re-outfit our ship for travel. And every once in a while I'll sell off my stored stuff that's not engineer modded. One to make room and uh, available my, uh, credits that way. But when I'm playing without the camera, and yeah, I have a day job too, so I gotta take care of that. But when I'm playing without the cameras, and the microphones and all of those things, you know, I can make a half a billion a day pretty easily delivering cargo. But doing the uh, editing and the filming and all this kind of stuff, worrying about sound and and the video quality and all those things, yeah, I can't do quite as much. But when I'm playing by myself without the my interaction with you, it even gets more boring. So, yeah, there's our warships again. Can't get enough of that. Especially the one on our side, that one's damaged. When we got close, we could see the damage. Yep, they're pretty amazing. Yeah, both of them have damage. Looks like in the same places. Pretty much look like a cut and paste. We created one with damage and cut and paste or copied and pasted the second one.
but I'm not sure I don't think they're truly concerned about real reality there's a lot of parts in the game that are not reality even of the year 3306 so that's not their top priority this left approval granted set down on landing pad 05 clear for automated approach commander Landing gear deployed. Okay. Touchdown confirmed. You may alight when ready. We trust this facility will serve you well, Commander. I'm gonna just put on cargo, I mean fuel tanks. See if they have a bigger fuel scoop though. Yeah, they just have a three fuel scoop also. Okay. That will probably do it. I'm going to look for... In a near uh, CZ, look for the nearest alliance. Hang on. Okay. Sis view. Sis left. I think I found a destination that'll be suitable. Good ways, 185. They're all Alliance stations. Okay. Six, 